I know what you're thinking, Miola. You have, uh, you've looked better. You've clearly had better days. Well, yes. Um, and it's kind of embarrassing to say what has done this to me. Uh, Dodo. This stinking little Dodo down here. That's it. This little dude here gave me a little nibble and uh, busted my, my eyes, my everything to bits. But that's not the worst of the news, unfortunately. For today, I hopped into my world, this beautiful world of Schwarzlheim, and, uh, well, returned to my base where my Moss Chops is currently alive and my Dodo is just chilling and, um, nothing else is chilling. It's, it, it, it's just me, my Moss Chops, my Dodo, and nothing. I don't know where everything went. I have no clue where everything went. Uh, this is still here. My ladder that I spent all day <laughs> building the other day. Uh, but nothing else is here. All my items are gone. All my materials are gone. Absolutely everything is gone. Uh, except for, yes, my ladder. And my raft is still currently just chilling out here in the water. So, yeah. That's just absolutely splendid. It's amazing. It's remarkable. It's the best thing in the world. Uh, but it does kind of lead me to where I'm going next. I think we have reached an inevitable point, a bit of a transition period, a bit of a, a fork in the road, maybe you could call it, for uh, I've been speaking to Mr. Chaos, the developer of the Primal Chaos mod, and he's advised me that maybe this isn't the map that is best suited for this mod. It limits spawns, it doesn't spawn all of the cool creatures that he has in store for us to find and fight, get destroyed by and maybe demolish along the way. Uh, so I, I think it pains me to do it, but uh, we need to do a little bit of a whoop and we're back on the island again. I know, I know. It's an all too familiar place now, but you got to do what you got to do. And everything, all the signs were pointing towards this being the best option moving forward. Not only are we on the island, but... Well, I got my items. I kept my items. Just the ones that we had on us. I don't have all my base items. So we are kind of taking a little bit of a handicap, which absolutely sucks. But in good news, uh, look at this. That's not a good example. That's just a level 140 parasaur. But that is a level 300. Hiding behind the other one. Uh, yes, that's right. We now have a maximum level of not 300, but level 600. No, that's level 80. Dang it. I was just hoping to like jinx it. Oh, there we go. 560 Pelagornis. Ain't that just beautiful? Yeah, that is the recommended. What is going on behind me? We have little sand parasaurs. Hey, little guy. Oh my goodness. Um, hey, I can get my parasol for parasol right this second. But yeah, we're going to be playing on the island moving forward. Um, I feel, feel like, like, I don't know, treat this as a bit of a episode one again. Part four, part two. I don't know. We're kind of like re re starting the series. Um, yeah, I don't know. Roll with it, guys. I think this is for the best. Better spawns, better levels, better everything. If you do enjoy the video, though, if you think this is going to just give that give the series a bit of more of a spark up the butt, then please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. Now let's get jiggling let's go so uh what are we gonna do well we obviously need to get ourselves re-established and right now i'm thinking of getting my hands on this little dude uh or maybe even just this guy level 300 like level 300 right now would be absolutely incredible thing wants 80 berries to team up that's just a tiny little bit expensive uh so you know what maybe i changed my mind it would just take this little baby over here instead uh i don't know how fast it's gonna grow up but Actually, I could just poke you to death really fast, right? I got some pretty good weaponry on me, right? <laughs> I forgot we're not starting from square one. Well, we, we kind of worked our way here, obviously, but um, it is what it is, baby. And there we go. We're going to get ourselves an instant level 140 parasaur. Now, we obviously need to get ourselves set up with a bit of a house, a bit of a structure, a bit of a base. So, um, well, I, I guess that hide's definitely going to help out. Can you just pop your head above ground, please, my little dude? Because... It's not gonna work with you down there. Uh, but where I was going with that is we need ourselves a bed. So let's go and, uh, dang it. I should have relearned all of this or, you know what? Let me go and relearn all of our lost engrams. I think we're gonna have to do that. Let me quickly, let me quickly go ahead and do that. Just on a side note though, taming paste. Alpha blood, elemental blood, bit of beta blood, bit of flower and mushrooms and mm, that stuff there's gonna be real, real handy. <gasps> the whip is back. Oh, this is a Scorched Earth item that didn't quite make the jump to Ark Survival Ascended, but here it is. 
Fantastic. Uh, not really that I'm going to be using it right this second, but it could come in handy. It most certainly will, I'm sure. The Chaos Forge, the Smithy. Um, I don't need many of these tools and stuff, but what we are going to need very soon are these arrows. Uh, I just need to work out how to craft up the narcotics to get them. Uh, crossbow. Don't know why I'm learning it. Don't know why I'm learning the bike either. <laughs> but uh, ultimately, I think that, that that'll at least get us going for the time being. Uh, I was looking for the Chaos Smithy though, and it kind of somehow eluded us. Yeah, these are probably the few items that we really probably needed to get our hands on. Um, but right this second, more importantly, before anything, the Parasaur Saddle, that is what we are going to need. So, uh, some fiber. If I can get my hands on some fiber, like right this second, um, we can at least get some Narca Berries. And with those Narca Berries, we can get some, um, we can get some narcotics. Obviously, that's what you do with them. And then, once we got our narcotics, we can go and uh, knock some dinosaurs out and actually make some solid progress. That'd be absolutely fantastic. But uh, first and foremost, we're going to need eggs. And I'm hoping this little parasaur that's following along behind me will, well, for one, eventually pop his head above. You know what? Come out here into the water. <laughs> he just refuses to get himself above land. Don't. Wait, where is he falling to? Don't not fall through the floor. Whatever you do, please. I might need to somehow ride him out of there because he just he just doesn't want to come above land. What is your problem, mate? What are you doing? I see you, Dodo. Yes, I'm going to have to stop you before you try to stop me, mate. Get wrecked. Uh, but yeah, we do need a regular Dodo. So that's probably... Oh, not that we need a regular Dodo. We're just going to need some regular dinosaurs to lay us eggs. My dude here is fully grown. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get the last little bit of fiber and we uh, might be able to glitch this guy out of the floor. That'd be fantastic. Alrighties. Need a bit more. We are actually high enough level as well. If we could get some flyers if we uh, really wanted to make that work. So that would be cool. Uh, now, yes, there we go. Fantastic. Nice. We've got it on the way. Just as planned. Um, just please don't fall through the floor, whatever you do. Because if you do, you're probably going to take me with you. And that would be absolutely horrendous. But what? <laughs> why? There's no reason for this to be happening. Um, can we like climb? Yes. No, maybe. Hold on. Hold on. Huh? Okay. This guy's, what's he doing? Like he, he, he kind of did it for a second there. He can, is this just a visual bug maybe? It might actually be the case. It might just kind of appear to be beneath the world. <laughs> this feels so wrong. <laughs> um, hey, look, it'll do whatever. It is what it is, I suppose. <laughs> but hey, good news. We can get um, we can get flies in this world. We couldn't do that in Spotsulheim. So that'll be a massive, massive boost for us, I think. Now, usually the beach is a pretty good place to go looking for some dodos. And we've got ourselves a female. Nice. All right, my little dude. Now, I want you to lay me eggs. That's your one and only purpose. That's all I need you for. So, um, apologies for this. I have... Oh, I forgot these, like, new ones kind of fire back at you like that. Now, how many berries are you going to want? Not many, I assume. Eight. A few more than I expected. That's right. Everything's a higher level. I just remembered. Oh, hi. Um, sure. Why not? Double. Double up. Why not? Cool. Let's do it. Um, here's another few berries. You are also quite beautiful, my friend. Go to sleep and I will grab you some berries. And you can also join me. The sooner we get these berries, the better. The sooner we get these berries. Oh, dude, hold on a second. There's like a whole little army of these little guys. Hi. Oh my goodness, there's little babies everywhere. Dude, this is good. This is really good. Um, why am I collecting berries? I've got a parasol for that. Hi, I'd like those 99 berries that you're holding out on me currently. Uh, here is five. You only need three. And, oh, we're going to have eggs coming out of our butts in a second. Oh, this is perfect. This is going to be so good. All right. So we've got mama, <laughs> which means we get to claim these two little dudes. And when this one here teams up in just a minute, we'll have ourselves another female. Okay. Between these five, we're going to have eggs, like, just plentiful amounts of them uh, i just gotta keep them alive and that's probably gonna be the toughest part out of all of this maybe i should inhabit this tiny little island over here it's not really an island it's a rock but it's it's 
It's got like grass on it. It's kind of kind of cute. It's kind of pretty. It could be kind of cool. Um, where are this going on? These little babies. There we go. There's one more. And where's your little baby before he escapes? Let's go and collect him as well. All right, five, five dodos just like that. Um, come over here. Follow my my. I don't know. My sandworm parasaur. I guess we're gonna give you a name. I'm gonna. I got, I got the perfect name for you, friends. Come here. I'm gonna call you Diglett. I mean, it just. Yeah, I don't know. I never thought I'd be calling a parasaur Diglett, but here we are. It just makes sense. Look at him. I mean, like really. If you were looking at him from this angle, he kind of looks like a Diglett. Kinda. Kind of looks like a Diglett, especially from this angle. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what a weird dude. Anyways, uh, I need eggs. So can you guys get crackalacking on that one there? That'd be absolutely fantastic. While you do, I, I guess I need to sort out my other structure problems. So uh, we're going to need a bed. I kind of already discussed that already. We're going to need a foundation to place that bed on. So let's just go and learn them all and see if I automatically qualify for none of them. That's fine though. We got the we got the we got the tools that we've carried on from our previous life that we can carry across uh, to help us out with that one there. I used up all my hide on the parasaur though, so we're gonna have to go and gather that. But we do have some sleeping bags, so um, I'm going to place that there down just in case things get a little pear shaped. In fact, let's place two of them in case things get really pear shaped. I uh, then I'm kind of thinking. Look, we're going to need some metal pretty soon. Um, we're going to need a lot of things really soon, as a matter of fact. I'm just trying to think about the best possible way of getting them. It's a shame I didn't bring my moss chops across. Or it's a shame I didn't craft a sickle before our world went and deleted all of our items. But what are you going to do? It is what it is, I suppose. So we're going to have to pick up our fiber for the time being until we get our hands on a Chaos Smithy. The sooner we get our hands back on the Chaos Smithy, though, the better. Uh, but unfortunately, to get our hands on the Chaos Smithy, we're probably going to need some metal, which might be a little bit of a pain in the butt to get our hands on. Uh, we are also... I, I mean, i got to get the Chaos Forge going. Flint, stone, and hide, which means i got some killing to do. On top of that, I need a farm so we can farm some veggies. We're going to get that in no time as well. Um, but right now, hide is probably the one resource that's holding us back. Also, hi. Beta Pteranodon. Level 280. I mean... Hold on, I just heard something. I didn't hear you, but... Yeah, I'm not going to... not going to bother. Actually, I could have tamed this. I could have tamed you! Why didn't I? Uh. Oh. I actually thought that might have hit, but it didn't. Um, hey, I forgot. We don't, like, need kibble to... <gasps> Regular Tyranodon! <gasps> no! Hold on. I can actually... I can actually maybe? Can I? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, I don't have anything, any ways to knock this thing out without punching it. All right. <laughs> this isn't going to work. Is it? This is so primitive right now. This, this is so wrong. But it feels so right. Uh, headshots. Yes, headshots. I'm going to... Die. I, I, I just realized what I was doing. So, <laughs> our first death in this new world comes at the hands of myself. That is a surprise to absolutely nobody. I mean, who's going to take my life other than me, right? Uh, everything, but I do it more often than anybody's. Um, why are all you dodos just like casually chilling in the ground like that? I guess it's got to do with their babiness. Anyways, let me go get my stuff back. That Tyranodon is most certainly disappeared by now, which is really, really disappointing. More baby dodos. Oh, we're going to have eggs coming out, but soon, super soon. I didn't even need them for long. I just need them long enough to get some beta dinosaurs. And as soon as we get the beta dinosaurs, then we can get the alpha dinosaurs, and then we can get the really strong stuff. But yeah, we just kind of got to get that first little bit taken care of first. Ah, buddy, 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 buddy! What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Chuckle that back on. And uh, you, my friend, as tempting as you are to actually tame, I think I just gotta... I think I just need your hide more than anything, mate. I'm afraid. Sorry. Sorry about this. You are beautiful, too. You are absolutely gorgeous. And now you're dead. So it just shows how far beauty gets you, hey? We do have this coming down, though, which is rather an interesting sight. 
It's just a white drop, but it's got those red rings, and those red rings can be mighty delicious sometimes. So let me get up to them. We're going to have to collect this. It could be some juicy goodness. I know, it's just a white drop. It's like the most basic of basic drops, but you just never know. You really do never know. I've got two levels up my sleeve. I'm going to put those into weight just so I can carry a little bit of extra stuff around because, you know, carrying stuff around is fun. Uh, and I'm honestly thinking of getting a raft. I learned recently that there is a location nearby that is really good for metal. Also, yo, I can see what's inside of this. A storage box. I need one of those. <laughs> I was either going to have to craft one or find one like this. We've got um, some cooked fish meat. We also got an ascendant itchy saddle. Damn. Um, a torch. You know what? Get rid of the rest of that stuff. We don't need none of that. Seriously, though, that's not... I mean, that's... that's I mean, an ascendant saddle in a primitive drop? That's nuts, right? I don't know if I've ever found an ascendant saddle in a primitive drop. That is that is craziness. Uh, but we got it. So, I mean, I could very easily tame a, a fish. I mean, a dolphin, not a fish. I, I, I could very easily tame a dolphin. And that'll be that. We will have a dolphin. We can, we, can, we can travel around really quickly with an amazing saddle on it. We might even be able to get a high level one. Dude, that's actually insane the more I think about it. Um, all right, let me track this because, yeah, like I said, I, I got to get my hands on this ASAP. Just need about 70 stone. Lucky we got these amazing tools to help us out. Come on. I knew we were going to be like Josh Short. Bam, got it. Fantastic. Love it. Uh, give me my Chaos Forge. And then I got to get metal. Um, or, I, you know, a mortar and pestle may be even more important, to be honest. Um, but we can get pretty solid metal from these little rocks. For now. It's not going to be like a forever thing, but good enough type of situation. There we go. Not bad, not bad at all. And then obviously we're going to have to go a little bit further and get ourselves, you know, a proper, a proper, proper, proper setup going. Um, speaking of which, could that proper setup be you know in our usual location that we generally set things up i'm talking of course about the one and only do we need a raft i don't know why i always end up on a raft lately it's just it's becoming a bit of a thing i guess i just i just always live on the raft i don't know what it is about the raft but um i think we're gonna need it uh i gotta get kill something to get some hide some wood i guess and a bit of fire but yeah we can do this like really easily yeah, I think this is the best move. I think we need a raft. <laughs> then at least I can carry my forge closer to some, like, metal. Because that's ideally where we're going to be going soon. Um, these guys here might be able to help me with some of my my hide needs. That 17, I mean, it's the start. There's a, a few more. Um, this is a male juvenile. I don't really need the male. Hello! What in the world did you just poop out? A Christmas present. I'll take it. And you, I may as well, uh, you may as well come home with me, little guy. Uh, okay. Interesting. Um, what is this? It's a Christmas present. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. Consume? Yo, <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. That's sick. I think this is the, um, so I've, I've reintroduced the, this mod, the Hypers cosmetic mod, uh, which just seems to be expanding to like ridiculous amounts. Um, I, I think that's what the present, where the present came from. Either way, that's amazing. Uh, 19 metal. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but that's awesome. That's absolutely fantastic. The terrible news right now though, is I am five, I'm five hides short of being able to get this saddle. So really um do i i'm sorry i really am i just needed that extra five hides i i feel guilty about that but now all i need is a little bit of fiber and a little bit of wood and we're set there's the fiber and with a little bit of chopper lopping we have ourselves the wood and just like that we got a wooden raft on the way. It would actually be really cool to get some foundations on there before I go jump into anything. So I think I'm going to quickly just collect a little bit more. 
Okay, so we got enough to get us two foundations, but I was hoping for a another two. Oh my goodness, there's a raptor. Hello. Hi. Hey. 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 What level are you? You're not dying. You must be a rather high level at 220. Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Um. Also, what in the world? Hold on a second. Hold on, dude. Just chill, 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 chill. You're, 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 you're buzzing me out right now. Where did that come from? And also, what is that over there? Hold on. What is that? What is that? What, what is that? What is, what is, what, 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 what is that? What mod does that belong to? Where did it come from? Where did it go? Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> um, all right. I, I got stuff to lose now is the only problem here. Um, I need to kill it. I can't tame it. So naturally, you got to kill it if you can't tame it. Um, okay, that is that is really interesting. I'm trying to get to the water as quick as I possibly can right this second. Uh, raft, come at me. Um, foundations. Let's let's work out how we're going to place these things um, as far to the back as we can, and then like just just straight drop it as low as we can. Bam, bam. Um, we can craft up one more currently. Let's do that. We will just onboard everybody up here and we can build the rest later. We don't, we're not, there's no rush, no rush, no rush at all. Um, yep, that will go there. Uh, how am I going to get these little dudes onto here is the, is the problem now. I should have like placed this a little bit closer to the land. But I, I got to work out what this wandering dude is. Something tells me it's going to be looted up. Like have a lot of good juicy stuff on it. So my little dodo army. It hasn't really attacked us yet, but... It's got a witch's hat. So naturally, I'm just feeling a little bit cautious about it. Um, should I be? I feel kind of guilty about that. Not to mention, probably should have tamed this raptor. That would have been a really good idea. Too late now. You know what? I'm pretty confident in my abilities. I reckon I could poke this guy a few times. And, and we'll be fine. I just want to get like a good solid look at this guy. I feel... Am I meant to? Am I meant to kill you? Strange wandering dodo. You're not attacking me. Trade. <gasps> what? Okay. This is cool. Um, okay, so we, we, we officially know what mod this comes from. I can do this is sick. This is, again, this is from the hypers cosmetics mod. So we can, I guess, grind up certain of these items now and get trophy dust, item dust, pet dust, coal. And we can trade for stuff. 53 sauropod vertebrae. We can get ourselves an Alice. A no! Yo, what are you doing? Stop it! No! No! You, no! No! <laughs> ah, are you kidding me? I turned my back for two seconds. Wondering, Toto, where did you go? Were you, were you, were you, were you, were you involved with this? Mate, I trusted you. Turns out you might not have been the problem after all. It was the alpha. <laughs> was that an intentional diversion? An intentional decoy? Oh, I'm actually livid about that. That that just sucks so bad. Um, no eggs either, right? We didn't get any eggs before that happened. Oh, oh man, that is that sucks. Uh, this guy survived. That's nice. At least it's a female and it can lay me more eggs. But I think everybody else died. Oh, my goodness. I'm actually crushed about... Hey, Trilobite. <laughs> How you doing? Um, oh, man. I guess it made my, you know, getting everybody on the on the raft job a little easier. But I don't know. I would have been happy to, for it to be a little more difficult. I guess. I don't know. That's kind of really upsetting. Um, why can't I harvest this thing, man? Hello! I'm just trying to get my... Some, some stuff off you. Okay, I don't know. Nothing's working. Everything's breaking. I guess uh, it's time to... Transport all of this. Onto the raft. Obviously with the sleeping bag as well. We don't want to leave that behind. And uh, it's just me and my little... Yellow... Beautiful dodo up here. My dude, you survived. Good for you. You are... You are my sunshine. You beautiful little thing, you. 
I can't believe that happened. <laughs> All right, storage. Check. Get that in there. Get that in there. Get that in there. I don't, I don't know anymore. Check that over there. Why not? Where is this? Get this and un undo the thing in my bobbies and then rotate it. Rotate. Rotate this. Face me. There we go. Look at me. There you go. Okay, fantastic. We get some metal going there in no time. That'll be lovely. Um, and we can also, hopefully, can I get the smithy yet? Uh, where is the better smithy though? Where's the better smithy? The chaos. Chaos smithy. This one right here. 50 stone and a little bit of metal. I do not have 50 stone, but I do have the metal. Um, let me get the stone. We can at least get the smithy. And then we can at least get tools and then we are set. Again. I think. Can't believe this. Hold on. I just need to avenge the death again. One's not enough. We gotta do it a second time. At least I can bowl of the stinking thing. Get wrecked, you... Hey. You, you break my... If you're gonna break something, break my shirt to free my abs at least, mate. Get wrecked, though. I should have known better. Alright, a little bit of blood. A little bit of hide. Might be able to get ourselves some better, some better protection and stuff soon, hopefully. Uh, but for now, it is time for me to set sail to safer pastures. I don't know where those safer pastures are, but I, uh, I have a, a certain little island in mind. And it's just across the water. Recently, I heard this island over here. Herbivore Island. One that I... I don't know, neglect for some reason. It's actually really good early game for metal. It makes a lot of sense the more I think about it. So uh, I think we're just going to kind of <laughs> set up over here and resource collect a little bit. Uh, maybe I'll even head into the little cove. Uh, plus, it's not too far from like over there, which is, I mean, kind of like where we started. So it's good. It's really good. Uh, that is assuming none of the mods that we're playing with go and break the island by spawning crazy stuff over here Which may very well be the case, but we're gonna cross our fingers and hope that that isn't the case I, I, I don't I don't know what to expect. I don't know what's over here. I'm just gonna pull up over here a little bit further a little bit closer in And what I'm basically thinking of doing Is actually I'm pretty full now. Yeah, I can I can I can bring a few up with me. We're gonna head up here and are these the metal notes? That is not a metal note. That is not a metal note. Is this metal? Where's the metal? I know there's metal up here. I just forgot what metal looks like. Aha. There it is. Hello. You are most certainly metal, aren't you? All right. We're back. We're back. Nice. Yeah, we're not going to be here for long. I might not even be here the night, but hello. We could, we could, we could grab ourselves a pteranodon while up here. Maybe once I get, like, set up with a mortar and pestle, we get some narcotics. We actually get some stuff that can tame some, like, you know, knock some stuff out. Because right now, no tranks. Got absolutely no tranks whatsoever. Um, and then, and then, yeah, maybe we'll consider the old pteranodon. That is an alpha pteranodon over there, right? Is it that one? Yeah, level 180 alpha pteranodon. So, so, so modern dinosaurs do spawn on this island. I don't know if that's a, something we got to be cautious about or not. Okay, I, I, I thought I saw some stuff moving over there and I thought some stuff was fighting. It's just a bush. It's just this big fella knocking down trees. Oh, it's a beta. That's a beta brontosaurus. Fair, fair, fair. Damn, that thing's massive. Um, fantastic. Good for him, I suppose. Good for him. There is my metal. There is some wood. Light it up, baby! And now we can get our hands on some, uh, some metal. Some, some good metal. Some game-changing metal. Which is just what we want. Well, I think I'm gonna spend the night out here. We're gonna collect a bunch of metal. Hopefully get it set up with a mortar and pestle. Build up some supplies and hopefully get back to where we ended last episode. And then, uh, next episode, greener pastures. Only moving forward. Hopefully getting closer to some, oh, some, some, some modern teams at least. But uh, hey, we're all going to have to tune in to find out how it goes. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it read those thumbs ups. But most of all, they have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.